and you're welcome back. It's Wake Up Nigeria here. I'm with Tope, and we have our final guest. We are joined by Fulari Emi Agubiade, a screenwriter, uh, also an actor, by the way, mm -hmm. and evolving film producer and director. Yes, now he was on the series Mystic River uh, for Netflix, Slow Country, and Unbroken, and a host of others. Good to have you here. Good to have you here. Thank you very much. Yeah. Now, first of all, you don't look like an Agubiade. You look more like an Adamu. I was thinking you're going to say Chibuzo, but okay. Nah, that's far from it, man. That's good, far sir. from it. But yeah, nice, luscious beard. Thank you. I think hey, that's hey, what's. Hey, it's normal to appreciate a man's beard. Mike, when you can't grow Mike, one. I need help. <laughs> I thought we only. I thought we only but, go but, to the girls. But then this is normal. <laughs> so a guy, a guy can't compliment a guy. Hey, you have. It's Mazino's compliment. The reason we is. kind of like know where it tends to, but this was like. I cannot. I, I cannot grow a beard, so I oh, appreciate people okay, who have beard, except okay. uh, Mike's, of course. This is the first time you actually say you appreciate people that Not Mike's, beard. not Mike's. His is yeah. very, very good. You, you would see Mike, and then you see Mike's <laughs> luscious beard. No, I, I've seen Mike's luscious beard, yeah, they're good. Okay, yeah. it's a little bit too much of the lusciousness. <laughs> How are you doing? Good to have you here. Thank you very much. How did uh, it feel being on um, a project that went to Netflix? Okay, so it was exciting, but I'm not sure of my face because I'm not really good at expressing my feelings or my emotions generally. But like, it was really exciting. It was. Uh, we didn't know it was going to go there actually when okay. we were shooting it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're just shooting. We shot 26 episodes. But well, you guys showed. No, you didn't show the whole. Thing. Yeah, yeah. I'm getting there. Okay. Works. I'll explain why <laughs> to you. So we shot 26 episodes. We're in the we're in the forest for three months. A forest where there was no lights, no. No. How did you charge your phone? Well, we had two for seven gen. Okay. But when I say forest, it was a proper forest, yeah. like zero network. Do you mind telling us where this is? It's Omo Forest. Omo? Omo Forest, Omo. not Omo. Omo. It's somewhere between Ogun State and uh, Ibadan. It's this really big place. I think it's as big as Lagos. It's a reserve, actually. Is it a reserve? Yeah, under, so under, under protection. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. exactly. So there, there are a couple of people who stay there, but like I think most the things they really do there, mm -hmm. so like cut trees and then you know use the woods for all this mm -hmm. other stuff. So there were like few houses that were there. So we so had to take out some of them. Yeah, we had to rent out some of the houses there and pay those people off. Mm. But then there was literally no light for like throughout our stay. There was no mode of transportation except when we were walk? going. No, no, okay, so when we we're going to shoot here, yeah, there is a company car that used to take us, like company bus. Okay. But like if you want to do anything other than that, you're on your own. So there was only one place where we could receive network to make calls, mm. right? And it was uphill. And it was a 30 minutes walk away from where we stayed. That person was the important. Yeah, exactly. So, <laughs> <laughs> so usually when we want to like go and make those calls, we have to go in groups because it's, it's a juice. forest. Do you understand? Yeah, it's a forest. And then yeah. we literally don't know what's, that's the first time I heard of a tree hierarch. I never heard of that before. What's that? What's that? A tree hierarch. What is it? What's that? So it's this wild looking rat. Oh. Not a rat. It's a wild looking rat looking animal. Okay. Okay. Right? And then it makes a very aggressive bark. Like, rrr, 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 like. It's rats. It looks like a rat. A rat looking animal. Yeah, okay. it, looks, it looks like a rat, but it's like big. Does it attack? I think it does. I heard that it does. He wasn't going to find out. Now. I, I mean, do you know? <laughs> <laughs> yes. so, so, like, there was all of that. So, we had to go in groups, and then it was a thing of make sure you write down every single thing you want to say on the phone. Ah, uh, so you don't so forget. So, you don't forget. Because one chance because you get. That's do you cool. understand? Like, you go uphill. That's like exercise on its own. Wow. So you go wow. all the way up, and then if you forget anything, you're wrong. Did your it own. pay off at the end of the day? I mean, all I mean, of this. Netflix, you, man. I, yeah. It, but, yeah. Yeah, I know. But I, I have hear a question. about. Of course, sorry. I, okay, yeah. You want to go ahead? Finish. Right? I, I hear about y people, um, uh, uh, your efforts getting on Netflix and all. But mm -hmm. exactly how much does it come back? How does it come back to you in terms of the amount? Is it really exactly worth it? Exactly what I wanted to ask. Boom! The, the, does it hit your account? In English, like, the money. Yes. Was the money great? For okay, three well, months. Oh, yeah, no, no, okay, it, it was actually. Animal. Yeah, it was. The money was good. I was even surprised when I got back, they even paid us extra. Because I think they realized that. Please, where is this for? Sign me up right now. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the production company? You they, know they, what? they paid us phone. extra, yeah, because they figured that we did too much for what they thought that they paid. And they were nice. like, you know what, you guys just add this wow. extra and all that. So it That's was all right. I mean, if it was, when we were doing it, like I said, it wasn't supposed to be for Netflix. Okay. So it became six episodes from 26. Yeah. Because wow, okay. Netflix wanted to buy the rights to own it. Okay. So is it a Netflix original now? No, it's not a Netflix original. A Netflix original will be one that was commissioned by Netflix. So okay. this wasn't commissioned by, by Netflix, Netflix, but the right to own it. Own it. So yeah. what happens to the remaining episodes? Well, I'm going to get there now. So we, <laughs> okay. about out of uh, 300 and something since that I shot, altogether, yeah, altogether, I think uh, about 17 or like 16 shows. There was someone who shot about 200 and something, only two shoot. And the first thing that she oh. even showed, she didn't talk. 
Wow. So, like, when it came out, I was excited. And I saw what happened. I'm like, ah. What's going on? Efforts wasted, man. Like, so even, yeah, I'm listening uh, to you. Uh, uh, my question would be, if you, and, and to you too, because you're, you're an actor yourself, if you put in so much and then so little comes mm -hmm. out of it, forget yeah. that you're getting paid. Yeah. It, it hurts. What does that do? Exactly. It how does. does that make you feel? And so, how do you move on after that? You just move on. Exactly, <laughs> like what she said. So the thing is, being an actor, I mean, when you first start, you might not necessarily know this, but like over time, you have to get to learn to just to move on. on. Yeah. yeah, you have to be, because exactly, you have to be very tough. It's not my interview, but there was a project that I did, yeah. and then there was this scene that took us like seven hours to shoot, and then when it came out, I was, the, the episode, I was waiting for the episode, when the, the episode came, we finished it, I'm like, no, rewind, there's this scene, <laughs> this scene, and it the editor cut it out. So, another wow. film I did, mm -hmm. I don't necessarily want to mention the name, yeah. but like, <clears throat> so I was a main character in it, and then it came out, I had one scene, I didn't even talk, what? I didn't talk, and then all I did was, I wasn't even allowed to say this way for that scene. So I just did, <laughs> I just did like this. Just and then, <laughs> yeah, so that was literally all it was. And then I'll tell you the crazy part okay. here. The crazy part oh was that. Oh boy. Just listen to this. So they, when the movie came out in the cinemas, because I didn't watch it, I was just out there. They gave me merchandise and all uh -huh. those things to go and share to viewers and watchers. So I got there and I was like, oh, thank you very much for watching our film. Here is the uh, merchandise. Mm -hmm. And they were just like, oh no, uh, who are you? Why is a random guy just oh, giving no. us shirts? Oh, I'm sorry. Get? It was crazy. Oh. And then I was like, why are these guys looking at me like this? And then my friend watched the movie and I was like, for I didn't Dude, see you. Did you know the deal? <laughs> the entire film. The was it, film. did they recast? They didn't recast. There was even press junkets and everything. Like it was a big deal. Like my okay. name was even, <laughs> like I had my own poster and everything. Oh, you wow. get? But so, so quickly, does yeah. this, how does this make you feel as an actor? Does it make you feel undervalued? Did it make you question your skill mm. as an Well, actor? like I said, so at the initial stages, yeah, you might want to question your skill and all of that. But I realized that what happens a lot of times, the movies are too long. Yeah, they have to And then to they have to cut off to... scenes. And then sadly, I wasn't like, you know, the meanest, meanest guy. So they yeah. had to look for ways to like, cut out scenes that could be cut out. Mm. <clears throat> Excuse me. So that was exactly what happened. And I, I've you've learned you, you, to just you, be cool with it. You've got other skills, however. You're a screenwriter, you're a producer as well. You're also uh, on your way yes. to becoming a big director. So yeah, one let's, day. Let's hear about all of that effort and how much work you're putting into that Okay, aspect. so um, uh, currently I have... Uh, about uh, <clears throat> two series that I've written down and a couple of other short films mm. and all of that. I have produced one. I did a, uh, what do you call it? Um, when you want to pitch something to someone, what do you, um, a, a pilot. Yeah, thank you. So I created a pilot for one and then I wrote for a couple of my friends some of their stuff on YouTube as okay. well. So right now, I'm mainly an actor. Mm -hmm. but, but like you said, budding, like I'm trying to get mm. into that part because I'm not so... I don't want to say this on TV, the whole limelight thing. Nah, I'm, just, ha, 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 I'm just going to leave it before fans will be like, oh, really? You don't even like that, right? Even Why get out. They are, we I won't try to help you. It's for me, you don't like, so get out. So, no. So, for now, yes, yeah, that's just that. And I'm really looking forward to being a director, you know. Yeah. And, um, you know, controlling stuff behind the screen, I really yeah. like to create, basically. I mean, okay. Creator. So in wanting to be a director, like, yeah. um, is it? Are you one of those that's just gonna happen to, or do you plan to go learn the know-how? Well, it. I think it's the two, two of them. So okay. it's going to happen, and then also I want to learn because I feel like if I'm going to do anything, I have to do it properly and understand the basics. Because mm -hmm. I think directing is just is beyond just the whole. Oh, do this, do that. You have to know camera angles exactly. and all those mm -hmm. things. So I need to learn that. I mean, I knew a couple of it due to my experience as an actor, but mm -hmm. I need to learn properly. So I'm going to do that, yeah. So what are you working on now? Mm. So What are you yeah. working on now? Well, okay, I'm not supposed... I can't oh, say... It. Yeah, exactly, nah. India. You know how it is. <laughs> but then, yeah, I'm working on something. And I have a couple of stuff coming out very soon. Okay. Mm. Um, that I can't see. No. <laughs> Imagine. No, but there was a comment you made. See. There was a comment you made before the, we went on... Before we came on air. Okay. And I want to talk about that. You said... Um, you mentioned how... Um, the project, the, the skits that we showed, and you said, yeah. this is not yeah. the image that yeah. you would like to show. Yes, thank now, you for that. Talking about the images you'd like to show, would it be that this, for example, this skit, now, was it at a point of, uh, in your life where you wanted to just be seen, and now you're looking back and saying, I don't think I want to see. Yeah, what, I, wanna that, see. that crossed what, my mind. Yeah, how, okay. how did that so, happen? Which is a make up your mind, Fola. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, I'll explain. So, the yeah. thing about me is that if you see these kids I do, yeah, mm -hmm. they are once in a while stuff, unlike okay. proper skit makers who post every day. So, I do it for crews. Crews. Oh, okay. Do you get, like, I'm, like I said, I'm very creative. Mm. I write a lot. If you check my phone, if you check my memo pad, you see, like, hundreds, in fact, thousands of 
ideas. Mm. So I just write them down. And I'm like, you know, my page is boring today. Let me just spice it up. Yeah, Spices put something. Skip. Because one thing mm. I realized, also I'm trying to grow my page. And one thing I realized okay. is that people um, share videos more. Yeah. Uh, you get. And then once your video is shared, people see you. Ah, I like this guy. Oh, this was funny. Oh, it's yeah. cute. Whatever it is that they feel. Oh, you think you're cute? I know I'm cute. Oh, but okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> but like minus that, if I'm being honest, like videos are shared more. So mm -hmm. I, I post those videos once in a while to help my brand. Okay. On Instagram. But you do not want to be seen. No, I'm not a skip maker, no. 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 Wow, no, no. that was so personal. <laughs> yeah, so like... I want to talk about the cute angle. Now, okay. as an actor and as a person that sees himself as cute... Who is also really cute, by the way. Who <laughs> says he's really cute, by the okay. way. And that brings attention from the female folk. Okay. Now, how do you manage that attention? Yeah. Mm -hmm. hmm. So, what I've learned to do is, is to yeah. air messages because it's not really good for me because if I decide to respond to the number of DMs I get, I would, I would cast. You're not very modest, are you? He's not. No, I'm just realistic. <laughs> <laughs> He's not. There's no modesty around <laughs> this, this, so, this street. So, like, if I decide to do that, I'll probably cast because mm. you know how it is now. No, we don't. I don't. <laughs> I'm, not. Okay, I don't no. I'm married. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> what I mean is that yeah. I haven't exactly gotten to where I would love to be in my yeah. career, right? And then okay. if already at this stage I'm responding to every Tom, Dick and Harry and then okay. before I knew it, one person just hangs out with me and then she's like, we're dating or whatever it's So are you in a relationship? It. Well, I'm a very private guy, so I don't know. Am I? It's okay. Listen, yeah, girlfriend, we, they don't know. we have your back. So we're <laughs> going to bring you over to the kitchen where we have yeah. a married woman. Okay. Yes. Of whom you <laughs> have. Who, does, who yeah. would like to know if she so, thinks he's so, cute? Don't worry about oh, whether no. or without. All right. MM and Mike will take care of you. All right, so I'm oh, sitting here. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. You're cute, by the way. Thank Thanks. you. Amen. An honest person. You just have to. Mind them. I got you. Thank you. Thank you very much. This is Chef is Yabez. Okay. And this one, of course, this that's Mike over there. Okay. The one who eats the food. <laughs> <laughs> Chef Yabez has made for you pancake sandwich. Okay. Ever had that before? So happy already. No, I'm show. just busy. I eat just rice and beans. I'm, oh, bread. I'm bread sometimes. <laughs> so quickly, we'd like you to have a taste. Mm. Let us know what you think. All right, so please go ahead. Okay. Let it be known that it was on Wake Up Nigeria you had your first pancake sandwich, please. Pancake sandwich, that's yes. the name. Okay. Yes. So quickly, Yabez, you want to tell us how you put this together? Quickly. So, to make the pancake, you just to use the flour, uh, flour, milk, uh, eggs, uh, baking powder. Then for the fillings, I use potato, uh, green pepper. Uh, Combination of vegetable. Of red bell peppers uh, and all the pepper, bell pepper oh, species. Yes, all right, great, fantastic. What do you think? Like it? Love it? Oh, you're not exactly sure how you can to try yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I, think, I think I'm good. I already, I already know how tomato tastes. <laughs> okay. right. So I think I'm focused right. on this, and I think it's really nice. You like it? Uh, yeah, I Is do. this something I that do. you think you can try over the weekend? Of course, yes, definitely. All right. Definitely. Maybe try right. one of those, you know, your significant others. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> the guys are still on the couch. Well done. I, um, Tokwe and uh, Mazino, you want to say any goodbyes before we Yes, uh, I want to say a goodbye. I want to say a word of wisdom. Sometimes make you do rich yourself. Because yeah. if you don't rich yourself, Who's just like for that now, who's yeah. going to rich you? I mean, you're, you're, cute? Cute, you're cute, you're cute, I mean, you know it. <laughs> all right, thank you for me and thank, thank you, you Chef Yabesa, and to all our you. guests for being a part of our show today. We love you. Thank you all so much. And most especially you watching. Till next time, have an amazing day. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, everybody. <laughs>